This is 2 Corinthians 2 and verse 11. And it reads, least Satan should get an advantage of us for we're not ignorant of his devices. I want to say Shalom. I want to give all praise and glory to Yahweh Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shah Ba'ashim, Waha Rekakodash. Honors be to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. All right, it's the brother Yahweh coming at you with another lesson to edify and comfort the Lord's elect. So Lord willing that this video is edifying, comfort, and exhorting to you brothers as well as your few sisters that's listening and learning. Right, the year 2024, the hope for your trouble, the hope for your fear. And we pray and hope that the most high Yahweh, why Yahweh shall bring all these prophets to pass in the time that we're living in. All right, especially in these times. All right, especially in these times. And we're living in some exciting times, man. And we see the Lord is working, right? We see that the Lord is working. As, uh, you know, you brothers and your sisters should be aware of this uh, assassination attempt on former president donald trump right it happened yesterday right he was in uh pennsylvania all right you had this guy attempted to uh assassinate donald trump and um you know through the spirit you know brothers been speaking on it you know hey we believe that this all was a psyops man all right this is all set up right to usher in more of esau draconian laws all right more of his draconian laws right to put more oppression on you babylonians okay hey these devils about to ramp up that persecution you know persecution they're gonna put more of unrighteous decrees in order all right hey now hey these uh, uh these government officials you know and hey, they're gonna start putting things in the order to you know protect these uh you know these governments you know these government officials they're gonna start putting, you know, unrighteous decrees in order to protect them, you know, and that's gonna give uh, these these local authorities, you know, more of a way to oppress you, you people, you Babylonians, you know, ramping up, uh, you know, security, all right, to have you people control, man. That's why, you know, I brought out 2 Corinthians 2 and verse 11. It says, at least Satan should get an advantage of us for we're not ignorant of his devices. Hey, we're not ignorant of this devil's devices because we know that this devil's going to come down having great wrath because he know that his time is being shortened upon the earth according to 2 Revelation 2, Revelation 12 and 12, Salaki. You know, according to Revelation 12 and 12, we know that this devil have but a short time. And we see that, right? And, it, and these people are showing their true intents. On how they feel about these leaders, these so-called leaders of America, right? And it's only going to escalate. It's only going to increase, right? These people are going to show their true intentions, right? Civil war breaking out. You know, these people waxing cold towards another. And that's what you see, man. We see a lot of people waxing colder in these latter days for attempt to try to assassinate the former President Trump, man. You know? Hey, that, 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 that's that's a cold spirit <laughs> but hey, hey the death side of the heavenly father got it set up man these people are going to wax colder and colder right and we're going to see more once again we're going to see more of these unrighteous decrees come into place man and that makes me think of uh revelation the book of revelation let me grab that and i just want to do a little quick in transit lesson right this is Revelation 13 and 11, and it reads, And I behold another beast coming up out of out of the earth, and had two horns, like a lamb, and spake as a dragon. That's right, man. And that's what you see. Hey, this devil is speaking as a dragon, putting all these draconian laws into place. Hey, watch, watch something come forth out of it, man, because hey, there's always a motive behind these devils, man. You know, there's always a motive. So you're going to see more of, of a security titan. You know, more of the security getting tightened, you know, giving the uh, authorities more of uh, of what's the word I'm looking for? More authority to really put the pressure on you people, you know, put the pressure on you people. And it says he spake as a dragon, man. That's the devil speaking and putting draconian laws into place. And once again, it's only going it's only going to increase because, hey, we see that this devil. Hey, he know that his time is running out, right? He know this time is running out, and these people are gonna wax colder and colder, right? And that's what you see. 
So watch, watch, you know, watch the motive of what really goes, what really go comes out of the the, the the assassination attempt, right? Watch you see more of these devils locking locking things down, right? And that's what the scripture speaks about Isaiah ten and one. Let me grab that. This is Isaiah 10 verse 1. Woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees. And right grievousness was they prescribed. That's right, man. A unrighteous decrees, man. More of these, these laws going to be in the place. And who is going to ultimately affect you so-called blacks, Latino, Native Americans, man? Giving these authorities to shoot on sight, right? And ultimately a bringing a, a, a solution. You know, problem, reaction, solution. Create a problem, get a reaction out of the people and come with a solution. That's what these devils are planning, right? So, hey, now it's high time to wake out of sleep because we see that the Heavenly Father, hey, hey, the Lord is working. The Lord is moving, man, right? The Lord is moving, right? So, you know, I just wanted to speak on that. Hey, we see this thing is, hey, is, is cracking down, right? And we're going to see more of the intentions of these people's hearts towards these uh, government officials, these government leaders, Right. So we living in beautiful times, you know, beautiful times to be alive in the spirit. Right. So with that, I'm going to give all praise and glory to Yahweh. Ba'ashem Yahweh Shah. Ba'ashem Rekha Next time, Shalom and a Bible ball.